Welcome to the tab walkthrough, or the actually, the, sorry, the singing and playing uh, lesson that will include a tab walkthrough for the song Take Em Away. Uh, this is a song that I recently uh, posted as a song of the week uh, on the YouTube channel. This is one that was uh, performed, written and performed by Old Crow Medicine Show. A great song, really uh, catchy. Uh, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised uh, that it's pretty easy to pick up as well. So like the other singing and playing workshops that we've done, I'm going to go through the process for uh, how to kind of go about uh, thinking about what you'd play on the banjo as you're singing along uh, with a song. And again, this is intended as an extension of the how and play to sing modules that are inside the Breakthrough Banjo course. So if you haven't, if you're a member of Breakthrough Banjo, you haven't been through those yet, I would, ex I would suggest um, doing so first and then working through these as, as a way of kind of cementing the knowledge uh, that you learn there. So uh, let's get, let's begin with, with um, I will play the song for you, uh, the video that I recently posted. And here that is. Take them away, take them away, Lord. Take away these chains from me. My heart is broken because my spirit's not free. Lord, take away these chains from me. Some birds' feathers are too bright to be caged. I know I'm not that colorful, but a bird just the same. Open up your gate now, let me put down my load So I can feel at ease and go back to mine Take them away, take them away, Lord Take away these chains from me My heart's broken cause my spirit's not free Lord, take away these chains from me Sun beating down, my legs can't seem to stand There's a boss man on a turn road with a rifle in his hand I got nine children and nothing in the pan My wife, she died hungry while I was plowing land Take them away, take them away, Lord Take away these chains from me My heart is broken cause my spirit's not free Lord, take away these chains from me Expect a man not to get lost. Every year I just keep getting deeper in debt. There's a happy day, Lord, I haven't seen it yet. Take him away, take him away, Lord. Take away these chains from me. My heart is broken because my spirit's not free. Lord, take away these chains from me. Land that I love is the land that I'm working. It's hard to love it all the time when your back is a hurt. Getting too old now to push this here plow. Please let me lay it down so I can look at the clouds. Take them away, take them away, Lord. Take away these chains from me. My heart is broken because my spirit's not free. Lord, take away these chains from me. Land that I know is where two rivers collide The Brazos, the Navaso, and the big blue sky Floodplains, freight trains, watermelon vines Of any place on God's green earth, this is where I choose to die Take them away, take them away, Lord Take away these chains from me My heart is broken cause my spirit's not free Lord, take away these chains So there it is. Take them away. Uh, and um, let's get started by getting in tune. So this, uh, I sang this in the key of D and used double D tuning on the banjo. So we've got D on the fourth string. And again, I've got it capoed up on the second fret. You can either tune directly to these pitches or capo on the second fret from double C. Although you still want to check your tuning. All right, so D on the fourth string. A on the third, 
D on the second, E on the first, and A on the fifth. Okay, now, um, so first I'll give you some thoughts about how to get started um, playing and singing for a song like this, and then I'll work through the tablature that I gave for the um, ba backup that I played uh, in the video. Um, and if you don't have that, you can get that by going to the um, link in the description. Okay, so let's run through first the chord progression. You see it on the screen there. So we have three chords. We've got our D major, our G major, and our A major. Okay, so we start with a D major. Take them away. Switch to G. Take them away, Lord. Back to D. Take away these to A. Chains from me. Back to D. My heart is broken because my G. Spirit's not free. D. Lord, take away these A. Chains from D. Me. Okay? And that chord progression is the same for both the uh, chorus or the refrain, which is this, ver this um, lyrics here that you see. Uh, and the verse, so the chord progressions are the, are the same. So those are the, that's all you need to know is those, um, the progression laid out there. So now um, <clears throat> the first thing that I would suggest doing, uh, as we talked about, is just playing bum ditties uh, behind your voice and singing along and um, and using sort of alternating on the low two strings, the fourth and the third string. So that would sound like this. Take them away, take them away, Lord. Take away these chains from me. My heart is broken because my spirit's not free. Lord, take away these chains from me. Okay? Good enough as it is, right? You don't have to do anything more than that. So there's a simple bum ditty and changing the chords as you go, and that sounds great. Um, the next thing you might do is alternate the pattern. To give it a little bit more movement. Uh, I like that particular pattern. I use it a lot. So basically what I'm doing, the bum ditty and then a drop thumb, um, bum diddy bump diddy kind of, except that I do the skip stroke on that first, uh, uh, on that second half of the pattern. So I'll do it real slowly here just to, to make sure it's clear. So bum diddy, skip, thumb, diddy. Okay? And I'll sing that. Take them away, take them away low. Take away these chains from me. My heart is broken because my spirit's not free. Lord, take away these chains from me. Okay, so you hear that. Now you can mix and match all those, you know, if you want. If you want to play bum ditty for a while and throw in one of those little drop thumbs every now and then. Sounds, whatever you think sounds good is fine. All right, so those are the first two ideas, and again, you could do, uh, that's perfectly fine to just stop there, uh, especially if you're still just kind of getting the hang of this. Um, but I will go and then show kind of, uh, walk you through what I did in the video. And again, like uh, talked about in the past, the um, sort of more advanced way of playing vocal backup is to start kind of emulating what you're singing or playing some of the melody notes that you're singing as you're singing them um, when you're playing back backup. So let's move now to the uh, tab for the vocal backup. All right, which is here. Okay, so now, as usual, um, I will be uh, using the little blue box to denote what measure I'm working on this guy. Okay, so this is the tab for um, how I played it, pretty much how I played it in the video. So this first measure sounds like this. So that's that little pattern I was just talking about. And you're gonna, you're gonna see this a lot. And then, so that's the first measure. 
So bum diddy, skip stroke, thumb to the open fourth, and then diddy, strum thumb. All right, then I move to this, uh, this shape on the fretboard. So this is the uh, uh, G major shape at the fifth fret, barring cross with, a, with my pinky on the seventh. Playing that same pattern. So that's how that sounds. And then back up to the D major chord. All right, so that all sounds like this. And with the singing, take them away. Take them away, Lord. Take away these. Okay. Now we're going to the A major chord. Chains from me. And now we have a little pause in the melody. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some connecting tones to lead to that D major. Like that. So that's this whole measure sounds like this. Away from me. Now we're going to the next measure. Back to our pattern. Back to a G major, but this time the down the neck position. So again. And I'm skipping this note here uh, when I play that. Um, but you don't have to. And then back to the D major. So everything at the top of the screen sounds like this. So with singing, way from me. My heart is broken because my spirit's not free. Lord, take away these. And I should say here uh, that I should say that, that this is the backup that uh, I typically used for the verses. Um, and then I and then in the chorus I went to the next uh, backup that I'll show you where I'm using the higher tones uh, to play on the banjo. So. This is this is, and I have this noted in the tab that this is what's used for the verse backup. All right, and then this is the last essentially measure of singing. Chains from me. So, and then here we have that little figure, this little melodic figure that we used in between the verses and the refrain, which goes like this. more time sounds like this okay so again me way from me way from me and then you'd go back to the next verse or refrain okay so that's the um that's using the lower tones and again that's what I typically played when I was singing the verse and this is what I play now uh, we're starting back to the beginning. This is what I would play uh, during the chorus. So <clears throat> similar, but we're just using the different tones, uh, uh, higher tones here of the banjo. So I've got my, we're back on the D major, but I'm fretting the first string at the fifth fret. So that's that first measure. Take them away. Okay. And I just like going using the low tones. The verse, the high tones, and the melody, and the in the um, refrain, it kind of helps to distinguish them and emphasize them. Now we're back to the G major, uh, down the neck, which sounds like this. This measure. Take them away, Lord. Back to the D major fifth fret to start with. Take away these. So that measure again. Oops. Now this one, back to the A major, away from me. And I'm just going to note this as a skip, because I skip it. Away from me. Last measure up top. My heart is broken because my... Okay, so everything at the top of the screen sounds like this. And with 
singing. Take away, Lord, take away these chains from me. My heart is broken because my... Next measure. Back to G. Spirit's not free. Same pattern. Back to D. Lord, take away these. Sounds like this. And now the A major. Chains from me. And then we end with that same figure. Okay, so everything at the top of the screen sounds like this. Sorry. And then of course the last note there that you don't see, okay? All right, let's see if I can uh, sing it. Not free. Spirit's not free. Lord, take away these chains from me. Okay, great song. Um, so once again, hopefully uh, you'll find that one's not too tricky to pick up. Again, you can start simple and build from there, as I said. Um, and... Uh, if you have any questions or comments about it, feel free to leave it in the um, comment box at the bottom of the Breakthrough Banjo Virtual Classroom page. And uh, otherwise, I will see you in the next video.